for this generation, this is definitely uh, you know a new, fresh take on the Musketeers. I mean, uh, and this one, you know, the Musketeers are seen as like the James Bonds, or the Navy Seals of their time. They're they're they're, they're weaponry experts, and they. Uh, they, they get all these fun gadgets and cooler things that people haven't seen before. Just certain things like the sort of the way the Musketeers are sort of like the rock stars of their age sort of and um, I think having it such a young cast in it for the roles that are supposed to be young like D'Artagnan and Constance and the King and Queen they were very very young in the book so I think having those young actors in it just kind of brings it down to the kind of reality of how relationships are when you're young and stuff like that. And it's also in 3D and the visual effects and the stunts and the scenes are all incredible and detailed. And it's just, um, it's unlike you know anything anybody's really seen before. It's quite nice though, because you don't quite know what to expect. And I think they've done it really well where they've taken it. It's sort of stayed in line with this sort of classical story, but um, the things they've added, I think are pretty cool. I had in school, so a while ago, but yeah. I mean, I grew up with it because of my grandfather, and uh, it meant a lot to me to do it for him because he grew up, I mean, he was a huge fan his whole life. I mean, it, it just you know, loves the story, and uh, to do it for him meant a lot to me. It's such a sort of famous story. It's sort of one of the great stories, so yeah. Yeah, no, I mean, I saw a lot of fencing films to prepare for, uh, you know, f you know, intricate detail, like fencing movies and all that, and, and tried to top them. They make this, you know, different and new and uh, more complex than anything that anybody's seen on film yet. Which was a high bar that we set for ourselves when making it, but stuck with that and delivered something original and cool. You feel totally different and it's any girl's dream to sort of dress up like that um, and be in that world of sort of you look like a kind of princess every day. but. It is quite tough to work in them because um, they are very uncomfortable. But it's something you kind of get used to. I think your body gets used to sitting inside a corset, so it gets easier. I don't know. I think maybe I'm yet to have my really grand romantic gesture. On New Year's, I remember one year, I, I, I went with um, a friend of mine to uh, to to you know had this whole you know dinner planned and all this you know nice stuff but you know at the end of the night we went on the top of this view this like I know like a lot of views in Los Angeles and right as all the fireworks went off all over the city and like different parts of the town you can see all the fireworks shows and it was um, it was incredible it was a romantic fun time.